Hey everyone, this is Manshark Sub LPs. I'm Sub, and this is Alpha Protocol. We are, of course, Michael Fortin, secret agent. And we need to go and check our email. Just a reminder, last episode, we, um, along with our good buddy Sean Darcy here, went along to an Alcimed uh, training slash detention camp, and pretty much wrecked shop. Anyway. Uh, Darcy has sent us an email, got to hand it to you Mikey, that was some great work out there. No alarms, no nonsense, just dead terrorist bodies to bury. That's the way every mission should be, in like a shadow, out like a horseman of the apocalypse. For the record, I'm not saying I couldn't have done better if they sent me. Next time I'll be in the field and you can sit back and play handler. Okay. And on the clearing house, we're back to having about 33,000 bucks. That's nice. Um, Plenty of pistol ammo. I think we're running low on shotgun ammo though, just because... I don't know, 43, that's not bad. I'm not using phosphorus slugs. That seems... illegal. Like, really. Yeah, and we're all good there. Oh, we can sell stuff, by the way. Like, I know we've got... Um, where is it? No, really? I don't want to buy that. Put me on something which is cheap and nasty that we might want an extra one of. Yeah, that'll do. Ah, yeah, there you go. So now we're on sell. So we can come here. We could sell our Hamilton AR-21, but we don't want to. What we will sell is probably the calibrated recoil springs, because we picked that up and we're not going to be using the SMG, so we'll get rid of it. Um, same sort of thing here. We'll keep a hold of these. Because they might be nice. But that's about it. Alright, back here. <clears throat> okay. So we've got two missions on the field. Intercept Shaheed and uh, recover the missiles is the final mission of Saudi Arabia. If I remember right. It's one that we unlocked last episode. What we're going to do today is bug the al Samed airfield. So we don't need to do this one. We already have 100% information on the al Samed group. So that saved us five thousand dollars. I would like a detailed map, so five seventy is quite nice. And you know what? I would like a precision rifle in a prearranged location. Right. Let's go check the telly. Forces report sporadic outbreaks of violence across the Middle East, believed to be part of a power struggle between rival terrorist organizations. Army spokesman Colonel J. Robert Powers tells INN that a suspected Osama terrorist training camp on the outskirts of Jassan was destroyed yesterday, allegedly in a daring daytime raid by members of the Al Ta'ir sect. In financial news, Halbeck Industries is facing intense scrutiny from shareholders, just the latest bump in a troubled road for the once mighty defense contractor. Halbeck has shown increasing signs of moving into a business slump, with profits shrinking and a reported 50% of their project... We've heard that already. We heard that last episode. Alright. <clears throat> New mission available. Yep, that's all good. That's all fine. Yeah, see, 100% information on Alcimed, so we don't need to buy that stuff. Yeah, we are going to bug the Alcimed airfield. So our handler today is Mina. She likes us, so we get plus five endurance. Uh, reports indicate Shahid may be using an airfield east of Jizan. Infiltrate the airfield, download the flight logs, and get out without being spotted. Uh, we have a detailed map, and we have a precision rifle. Oh, Mike, there's one in an area. Congratulations oh, on hey. bringing in Nasri. They're interrogating him now. Anything on Shahid? No. We've got a lot of information on arms trafficking in the region. We should be able to shut down a lot of pipelines before people get hurt. But nothing on Shahid. Nasri's not talking? Damn it, I thought for sure. Maybe bringing him in was a waste of time. I don't think so, Mike. You made the right call. Anything come up you need my help with? So you've been with Alpha Protocol a while, then? Not as long as Westridge. 
and not nearly as long as Parker. This assignment with Shahid is probably the biggest one I've been involved in. What other assignments have you been on? I went undercover with Parker in Milan as a contractor for Halbeck. It's how we found out the missiles were gone in the first place. <sighs> Although it was too late to stop Shahid. The incident with the airliner? Well, we'll catch him this time. He won't get another chance. I hope so. I feel like if we'd been a little quicker with analyzing the data... Don't beat yourself up over it. What's done is done. Let's focus on the next step. You're right. We're closing in on him, and it shouldn't be much longer. Still, with Alpha Protocol, what I don't understand is why the United States would want to keep this operation secret. Don't they want Shahid captured? I think it's the missiles that are the problem. Helbeck's a substantial government contractor. The fact the missiles were involved... complicates things. Complicates things? As in... they're a potential embarrassment to Helbeck? I think that's a big part of it. U.S. weapons used to kill U.S. citizens? Wouldn't look good on a front page, even if the missiles were stolen. Alpha Protocol does a lot of operations like this. I don't know all of them, or all the names this program has had. It carries out missions without the knowledge of other U.S. agencies. I'll be curious. Like what, the CIA? The CIA, the NSA. Most congressmen don't even have a clue this program exists. It's designed to prevent red tape. And if it's found out, it just gets buried and renamed. Renamed? To beta or gamma protocol? No clue. Parker probably does. He's been here the longest. Whenever it's in danger of being exposed, it closes shop and a new one opens up. Interesting. I guess that's good to know. Wonder if I'd get a new name if Alpha Protocol shut down. I don't know. We might get new names, new identities. Or fired. Can you tell me anything about my mission here in Saudi? Probably nothing Westridge hasn't explained already. If you infiltrate the airfield Shahid uses, I may have more practical advice. Why is that? I'll be your handler for that mission. Don't worry. I'll be gentle. I know it's your first time infiltrating an airfield. As long as you're backing me up, I think I'll be in good hands. That's very optimistic of you, Agent Thornton. But I appreciate the trust. Can you tell me anything about Shahid? Not much more than you'd find in his dossier. His personal fortune doubled in one year when gas was $4 a gallon. And he likes feeling safe when he travels. What do you mean, safe? While well, Al-Samad is mostly untrained civilians using Cold War guns, his personal bodyguards are well-trained. And judging from the missile used on the airliner, let's just say he makes sure they have cutting-edge tech. This seems like a big assignment for a new hire. There must have been other candidates. There were other candidates, including Darcy. But the recommendation was based on Parker, Westridge, and me. Although when I made my recommendation, it wasn't about Shahid. It was about the larger mission. So why me? Because I think when given a choice, you're going to choose the people of a country over the heads of state. And that's not a choice many people here would make in the same circumstances. Especially Darcy. To be fair to Darcy, though, he has family issues that prevent him from going. Notably, his father. According to your dossier, your family isn't an issue. Is that all I am to you? A dossier? Until you arrived at Alpha Protocol, you were. Not anymore. I think you're someone who does what's right. And that's what I'm counting on. That's all I need. Thanks, Mina. You got it. Call me oh. if you need anything else. So... Of the three handlers that we've handled, that have been handled by so far, you can tell Westridge is very matter of fact. Do the job. I'm inside. Darcy is sure is a lot of security. Honestly, a bit. Tell me about it. There's hardcore. cameras all over the Let's place. Let's just kill this bloke real quick. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. They've got something here worth protecting. And um, Mina is kind of a low casualties kind of person. Anyway, let's have a look at some stuff, because we did pick up a few things in that uh, conversation. Did we get... Oh, yeah, we upgraded um, her perk to plus 15 now, which is very nice. Oh, hey, we get plus 20% because we uh, arrested Nazri. Nice. Didn't even see that one earlier. Yep, that's all fine. Let's get out of here and go to Intel, because we definitely got some Intel. Faction... I don't think we've got anything new on Alpha Protocol. Nope. 
did get something on the CIA, so here's a typical CIA operative. Cool. Uh, yeah, don't... If you find CIA on, on site, don't um, attack them. Because, you know, bad. And we got something on Halbeck, I think. No, I don't think we got anything else on Halbeck. Okay, let's go to individuals, because we did get a bit on individuals. Um, let's see. No, nope, that's fine. We know Parker doesn't particularly like us, but that's because, you know, reasons. I wish it would tell you what was new. Ah, okay. So, this is the family issues that they were talking about. Darcy is, um, constantly sidelined by, um, he doesn't get to do field work a lot because his father is a senator. So, you know. Get anything from Leland? Yeah, we're now trusted with Mina, which is nice. Um, was there anybody else? Yeah, Nazri. We've already dealt with Nazri. Alright. Um, we wanted a map, sorry. Right, we are here. Infiltrate the airfield, bug the tower. Um, we have a couple of points of interest here and here. This is probably where our sniper rifle is. So let's move around. I think that's the only way we can go. Let's just check. Yeah. Cool. We've got to work our way past this. That shouldn't be too hard. We'll go underneath it. Hmm, can we go underneath it? Almost doesn't look like we can. Okay, we'll go around it instead. And of course, activate awareness. Okay, there's a dude up in that tower, which is where we need to get to. There's also some gents on patrol. Judging from the schematics, All right, there's a security gate cutting you off from the tower. Any way around it? Should be a terminal for the gate in one of the buildings. Aside from the panel and the gate itself, but... Walking right up to the gate will leave me exposed. Got it. I might be able to find a way over it. Hmm. If you can fly, then you're welcome to try. I think you'd be surprised. I don't think there's anybody beneath us. Whoop. guy coming around this corner who was a little bit too uh, close for me to deal with. So we'll just hide in the shadows here for a little bit. See what he does. Good. What do you know? It's got a silencer on it too. Oh. Ah, oh, beautiful. No zoom level, unfortunately, and it's only here. We can't take it with us. Where'd the guy down here go? Oh, there's the camera. Ah, oh, hi. It's twitchy as hell, by the way. Like, this is not easy to move around. I know you're over there. Missed. It was super loud. 
Got him. <sighs> We've been made. Whoops. No, no, no. Go back up, go back up, go back up. What I want to do now, because he didn't sound the alarm like he probably should have, is I want to see if there's anybody else around. Because I'm sure there was. Okay, a few people over that way. I wonder if... You guys interested by that? There was an explosion. We seem to have unlimited ammo on this thing, so, you know. I'm not going to shoot the cameras because that will set off alarms. Although, that might be a decent way of getting people out here. I just jump through that now. That would be very nice. Well guys, it seems like the uh, sniper rifle was a bit of a waste of money, but it was only a couple of hundred, I think, 900 or so, so you know. Could be good in the future. Alright, what do we got here? 500 bucks, some phosphorus slugs for the shotgun, Health? Ooh. I see this one. And that one. Beautiful. Alright, that's the gate sorted. I don't know if that's going to, um... Spawn anybody in. move quickly. Okay, one, two, three, four. Some pistol ammo, sure. We did basically unload the clip on uh, that other guy. Is there anything up there? I can't really see. We should have checked that. Actually, yeah, he could have been kind of difficult to take down without the sniper rifle. Ah, there's nothing up here. Alright. Down all the way. Nothing else out here. Ah, oh, really? You won't let me make that jump? Oh, hang on, there's a ladder here. <clears throat> a zip line, where's it go? Oh, that's not really a good position. There's like dudes in that hangar. Whoops. Did not mean to do that. There's totally dudes in that hangar. Much better. That's the other great thing about this game. The more missions you do, they um, actually influence later missions. So we do have that mission to intercept Shahid, 
But by taking out his elite guard here, we won't run into them there. There. Looks like someone's alert for some reason. Now he's not. Okay, there's two of them down here. Okay. Only two? Okay, only two in here. Ooh, a duffel bag. $500. They're both red ski masks, so that means they're both, um, you know, top guards. Uh, no, 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 no. Back up, back up, back up. Jeez, Mike. Getting way too particular to do that. Oh, come on. He's got armor, which is a big concern, actually. I don't know if we can take him out while he's armored from range. What about this guy here? He's probably got armor, too. So let's investigate patrol routes. He walks up there. He walks that way and immediately turns around and walks back here where he pauses. He walks down to here. Pauses there. Which that would normally be where we take him out, but I don't think our gun's good enough to take him out in one shot. Do you always do the same routine? Yes. Okay, we gotta go. Alright, great. I'm going to shank this guy and then try and quick shot kill the other guy with a double tap to the head. I'm just a little cautious because of the armor. Come on, you turn around. Wonderful. God, it feels great, huh? <laughs> oh, and that was... Not to toot my own horn or anything, but that was well done. Hey, hey, some more stuff. Uh, pistol ammo. Pistol ammo. We got some ceramic inserts or something. So that's handy. Alright, how we doing? Okay, there's a guy out. Two guys out there. Camera. Alright. There's a keypad on that door. Alright. Turn around. Where is it? I see it. And that's that. Good job. You've shut down the hangar cameras. Mm, the ones at the tower are on a different circuit, though. It's cool that we're getting a lot of reputation of Mina just for doing the uh, side objectives. Hey, some more shotgun ammo. Nice. Uh, we want to go upstairs just to see what's up there. Doesn't look like a whole lot. Yeah, we can't go that way. Is 
the dude of a 50 over there. We can't hit him with a sniper rifle, he's blocked by that hangar. Ah, what do we have here? Drop point? No zip line, which would just put us down there, that's fine. Uh, let's just do an awareness check. Okay, dude in the tower, dude down there, dude there. Okay. Just the three dudes? Okay, the guy in the tower is the worst one. Um, he's going to be difficult to deal with. So we're going to cheese a little bit. One. Two. Oh hey, we got a perk. Pistol proficiency, plus one accuracy because we've got 50 critical hits. Alright. Oh, I guess we could have... I don't know if it's not an actual door we can use. Okay, we shut down the main cameras, so this one isn't active. One over there still is, though. I think it wants us to go through that door, but we're going to come up this tower first. Just in case there's something in here. Nope, just for 50. Which, we're not going to use 50s if we can help it, because I think that's bugged. That was a mistake. I can't actually hit him, because you can't move when you're in quick shot mode. So we just let it go. And it still makes a little gunshot noise, even though you didn't actually use it. Okay, there we go. So there's a guy there and a guy in there. Let's get in here and see if we can just shank this bloke real quick. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Alright. This is a little unfortunate. Oh, hi. Stealth! Whoa! <laughs> Somebody out here has a cannon. Alright. Quick look around, because I remember that. Yep. Okay. I think... I think somebody had a 50. <laughs> no alarm was raised, so that's actually really good for us. Can we get up there by any chance? No. on the other side so it doesn't hit us. It's literally the only way you guys can come. Mm, that's a bit worse. Oh, there's a... Oh, that's on their side of things. Okay. Resets? Come on. Looks like they got a stockpile of weapons here. Let me see if I can destroy these crates before they get shipped down. All right, Mike. But the control tower comes first. Alarm's still going off. We have to deal with that.
I don't mind a shotgun. Alright, I think we can shut the alarm off now. So that's gonna be that one, that one, I think that one, and then that one. Lovely. Well, we kind of walked right into that. One should do it. Perfect. Oh, the ladder's on the other side. Okay. Ooh. Just want to get up here so we can have a little bit of a look out. Oh, there's also a zip line. Lovely. There's definitely someone in that control tower. Oh, are we not in time? No, we're not. Hmm. Alright. Back down, we've got a bit of hunting to do. Excuse me. Alright, back to chain shot. I mean, yeah, we've been in here. We want to destroy these weapons. Oh. And that's the last of them. Well done. Now for the tower. Ah, we've now got a friendship with Mina. Which I think that means... Is our perk upgrade? Nope. Hmm. Can't jump that, that's fine. Can use the zip line. What zip line? Oh, okay, that zip line. I never saw that. Anyway, here we are on the top of everything. Let's just have a quick. There is an item thing down there. Um, it's a enemy drop. let that sweep over. I don't think it's in range. Yeah, so an incendiary bomb. Quite nice. Um, yeah, I think I want to go in from the top. Oh, we could do it this way. Uh, so that's going to be one, two, three, four. Almost fucked it. I don't know where he's gone to now, so let's just put awareness back up if we've got it. We do not have it. I think I just saw him though. Yeah. We're not going in... Actually, you know what? Fuck it. I'm in the control tower now. Look around for any computers. They may have flight records stored on them we can use to help track Shahid. I really need that awareness, thank you. Nothing here. Four guys. That guy there. I wonder how his movement tracks. I hope he doesn't look in here. Looks like he's not going to. His problem. Now your problem... Was that a lockbox? Ooh. Not a very difficult one either. Yeah, yeah, we got a perk and 100 XP and a level up. What else did we get? $5,000. Okay, well, let's find out what that perk is. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Breaking and entering. Um, okay, we just got 100 XP. That's not bad. Ah, and look at this. It's unlocked um, up to level 7? 
Yeah, up to level 7. Very nice. 13 to spend. Of course, we're going to buy one rank of pistols. Hmm. I'd really like to get evasion. That would be very nice. So we will pick up a rank in... Hmm. I don't want too many activatable abilities. Because when you get activatable abilities, the issue there is that... Um, Well, the main issue there is that you have too much stuff to handle. However, these are already very good. It's kind of an invisible thing, which is kind of stupid. But getting basic evasion is very nice. However, I think we're just going to increase our martial arts by two ranks. So that gives us a free strike combo and lets us do more damage. The problem there is we can get locked into a combo, which sucks. You've seen that happen to me a few times, actually. Oh, shit. Nothing. It's absolutely nothing. Turn around. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, hi. Thanks for the warning shot, by the way. I didn't see what we just picked up. This looks like what we're here to find. Maybe what are we actually here to find? Bug tower. Ah, oh, yeah, when that's not what we're doing here. All right. Um, let's get hacking. Yeah, there's something over here. Yeah, I see it. There, that one. Yep. And then. Oh God. I see it. Got it. Done. Transmitting the logs now. Why, thank you, Mr. Thornton. It seems you found the Al-Samad flight records. Can't wait to analyze these. Ooh, there's a thing over here. More pistol ammunition. Uh, let's get aware. Okay, still two of these two fellows. Moving around. Shank. Is there anything in here? There's something around here. Twenty five hundred. I'll take it. Why did that... I don't know how he saw me. Okay, there's that one. And this one is right down the bottom. Hey, every little bit of experience counts. Probably still one up here. Hang on, there's a locked door right here. Let's get through it. Oh really? Was that just out here? Alright. We've been out here before, so don't worry about that. Head upstairs, see what's up. Anyone up here? So I was right about them having like, the armor being an issue. $2,500. Ooh, that looks interesting. $5,000. Okay. Luck a bit out with that placement. It's right down here in the corner. Just there. Receiving. Link 
Keep strong. We're good. Now get out of there. Okay, we got the data theft perk, which I believe is just going to be... Yeah, some extra experience, which is nice. Oh, and we're done. Uh, several weapon caches at Pating were found and destroyed. Also, add out of eight objectives. Nice. Got 20,000 bucks from that. So, yep, lowered munition supply of terrorists in Saudi Arabia. Um, we encountered and killed his elite guards. So, reaching Shahid should meet with less resistance when we find him. And we obtained the flight records. And we hacked into a computer and transmitted additional intelligence. Nice. Mike, you made it back from the airfield. We'll be professional. I was worried that once you were spotted... Security was heavier than I was expecting. Still, I should have been more careful. I noticed the security. It may be a good sign. It means the airfield is important to Al Samad. It may be a problem in the future, though. If Shahid feels we're on to him, he'll bring his elite guard in, which could make your upcoming missions more difficult. I'll have to be on my guard then. Not much else to be done. Is the bug transmitting? Loud and clear, no problems. Parker's on it now, which is why I called. Looks like we have something. Shahid's coordinates and an ETA. How reliable is it? 90%. The information we got from Nasri helped. And the data you and Darcy secured from the detention camp let us track the missiles. It looks like this is it, Mike. Westridge will be with you on the comm, and I'll be monitoring in case things get... difficult. All right, then. I'll get my gear and head out when I'm ready. Good luck, Mike. Cool. So let's see if we got a memento for that. I don't see anything that's kind of changed. bathroom would be a bit of a weird area to put it. Hmm. Yeah, oh, she didn't get us anything. Not that I can find, anyway. Well, maybe around here in the... Oh. Oh, that's a shame. Come on. I mean, I guess there's not too much that you could really consider. Anyway, I think what we'll do is call that the end of the episode because, it, you know, the next mission will take us more than 15 minutes or so that we'd have left normally. So with that in mind, I've been Sub, you've been yourselves. Later.